Welcome to the Pin My Setup Highlights for episode number 99. The first setup was submitted by Jack, since it's a dual person setup. Uh, normally when we see that, they're not super clean. They're, you know, a little messy because you have two people using it and that's bound to happen. But in this scenario, it's it's really nice. It's clean, it's got the extended mouse pad. Uh, really, cable management's pretty damn good. Everything's nice. And to know that he has the gaming PC on the other side of the room is is crazy. I mean, that's not, that's not easy to do. And he did a great job with that because I don't think it's gonna be the most comfortable setup for the second person. They're like squished with that wall behind them. Yeah, Think yeah, about yeah. them having a door, like, I mean, not a door, a freaking chair. Like that's not probably the most comfortable thing ever. Also, um, one thing I see is the MacBook man is just shoved underneath the monitor. Um, I'm pretty sure it gets very annoying just trying to yank it out without actually damaging the Mac, without actually hitting the, the shelf. Mm -hmm. So I would probably get like a, like one of those MacBook holders, just like to stand it, like a stand. Yeah. But see, that's the thing. Then he he's running out of space because he puts that there. He doesn't have a lot of depth with the shelf above. So it's like, that's why a new desk could possibly be a good idea. Jack scored a 91. The next setup was submitted by Aiden. It's a white setup, man. It's a great look. I like the, the, the tower for the PC. It looks nice. Um, the DX racer kind of seems out of place just because it's black and red. But man, it's a chair, man. It's better than my chair. I had, I had to have a pillow on mine just to be comfortable. So <laughs> it yeah. gets the job done. I mean, it's, it's nice and it's always hard when you're up against a window, you can't really put anything on the wall, but you do have that right side where I think in this scenario, cause you are going for that white, I would go for like a minimalistic, you know, something related to what you love to put on the wall. Uh, even if it was just a shelf to kind of fill out with a little bit more about yourself, because looking at this, we don't know too much about you. I know some people want to keep that minimalistic look and just, you know, keep it all white. Then uh, if that's what you want to do, go for it. But I definitely think that uh, something, just uh, just a little something to, to show us a little bit more about yourself. If you're going to keep the, the red, why not flow a little more red through the setup? Um, even simple things like changing the wallpaper or getting some black and red accessories to kind of bring it in so you have that contrasting with a dash of like red. Aiden scored an 82. The next setup was submitted by Frederick. The King Kong man, um, I mean, it's it's, it's it's good to have a poster on the wall, man, but that's kind of too small. Okay, I like the tabletop, nice and clean. I like that sit stand. I like that you're utilizing the MacBook to, uh, you know, do all your work because of the kind of work you do, that's, that's what you need. Um, I would recommend, like you said earlier, something to put uh, like, like a stand because you do have the room to put it on a nice stand and, and tilt it in the corner. That way you can utilize all three screens. Maybe you have email or chat or something up on the Mac. Frederick scored a 70. The next setup was submitted by Miles. So what do you think though about him having all the domos like right around the monitor? Do you think it's like in an annoying spot and he should have pushed it more to the side or do you think it's not that bad? It's not that bad in my opinion. Um, You're talking about the figurines, right? Yeah, like the, they're, I think they're called domos, the little brown things. Yeah, well, all of mine's are around my monitor, man, because sometimes, man, when you're playing, you know, you just like to, you like to see what you like right in front of you or like around you. It's just, it's just a nice vibe. You don't want to just see the monitor sometimes. Yeah. For being a 13 year old, man, you, your imagination, man, you, you showed it in your room, like honestly. Miles scored a 90. The next setup was submitted by John clean up a bit man like yeah. you know Pikachu is just chilling in the corner man he has a smile on his face but I can tell it's a fake smile because it's just <laughs> too much stuff going around him yeah well like in all honesty though this could be fixed so easily because it's just crap I mean he's, what is that a nerf gun I mean it, it's almost like it's a joke but he was very serious and I know he's, he's been watching for a very long time maybe get monitors that are the same size because that the one on the right I know it's uh, on Facebook Mm -hmm. but it's too small to be next to that bigger monitor and then you have that big TV on top. Mm -hmm. I don't know, it's just mismatch. I like to match. Um, yeah, just clean up, man. That's all I can really say. That's all I see over, this, over the desk. Like everything's just thrown. It's like, it's like he just quarterbacked everything onto the desk. John scored a 20. The next setup was submitted by Logan. I see the lamp on the bottom just laying on the ground. I don't know what's up with that, man. I mean, does he need lights to clip his toenails or what's going on? <laughs> He's, you know, he's doing a little bit of presentation for the photo for some odd reason. The little section right there by the window, maybe that needs to be cleaned up a bit. I used to have an apartment and it was the same situation with me. I used to do that also, but yeah, definitely clean that up a bit. I mean, it's, it's a pretty decent, I think it's too bulky. The desk is too bulky for the, for the, what he has on the desk. Yeah. Cause all he has is one monitor, keyboard and mouse and two speakers. I feel like you can definitely have more space in your room with a smaller desk. If that's all you're going to have there. Uh, the printer. 
why is it not up on the left side? I mean, unless you use the left side for homework and you need that open space, like right where that lamp is, put the printer there. Why is it on the floor? You know what I mean? It's very simple. He said it's a simple setup. He's right. It's literally straight to the point. Um, at least it's clean uh, underneath. I mean, it's, it's simple. I, I agree. Clean off the windowsill. Maybe put some more stuff up on the wall where it's just empty over there. Logan scored a 77. The next setup was submitted by Jake. I definitely think that personality, it's there, but spread it out a bit, man, because it looks just like you said the pictures in portrait. It, it goes with it like everything fits. It's like one rectangle on the wall. Like spread it out, man. Like make the make the wall look alive, you know, not just a, like a rectangle. Yeah, um, I, I definitely I definitely think that's something he needs to work with. Um, the LED touch, I mean, it's it's not the best desk, but it, it makes it actually look better. Yeah. Um, I see one speaker. I don't see where the other one is at. To that poster, the poster should be dead center. The the shelves should be on the left and right side of the poster, and you should play with it like that. It gives it a little bit more room. It would look a lot better. Jake scored an 83. The next <laughs> setup was submitted by Eric. You took the most unflattering picture of your setup ever. You know, trust me, you can take a bad photo of your setup, just like you take a bad photo of yourself. Uh, if this camera was like up a little bit more and tilted down, it would yeah. look way nicer. Well, I definitely like the American flag, you know, on the wall. Mm -hmm. uh, give him props for that. It looks like he has a collage of photos on the left side. So literally is nothing. And it, it kind of makes me worry. Like, I hope this kid has fun. You know, he's not just, uh, super mature which it's fine to be mature but it's like this is a very adult looking setup and uh again not a bad thing but i mean i just i don't know what he does but if you're going for that adult look i think you got it eric scored an 81. the next setup was submitted by ethan i mean you know what's funny the first thing i noticed is all the controllers and he's got i'm trying to find out where he's got all the consoles because is that a yeah he's got like n64 controller where? Yeah, that's a, that's a Nintendo 64 controller, definitely. I see a 360 and the PS3. I definitely see a lot of old school controllers, and I see a, I think, I think that's a PS4 controller, Xbox One controller on the far right. But yeah, yeah, you're definitely right. I don't see any consoles. Way too crowded. The left side is yeah. like a shrine for boxes. You got to just throw the boxes out, put them in a closet, get rid of them. You know, it's just really over the top. But I like the, the controllers, how they're just spread out, man. I'm, I'm assuming, you know, he's just a big gamer. Mm -hmm. So... He just wants to like show like the different uh, eras of game of consoles. I mean, that's nice in my opinion. Everything kind of comes together. It's really, really nice for your age and you are working with a small area. Um, so I think it's great. I really like it. Kudos to you. A little bit of cleaning up could take it to the next level. Ethan scored an 80. First place went to Jack with a 91. Thanks for watching this Spin My Setup Highlight for episode number 99.